Hey guys, this is uh, Monster Mike, and this is oh, Waste on TV. At no, the table. sounding board. Oh, sounding board. Sorry, sounding board. Because we're talking about a product. Oh, sorry, it is the sounding board. Because I... you haven't brought any food or anything to talk about at the table lately. Okay, so this is sorry. A so we can sit there and watch you eat. That's why maybe I should. I said we should bring a stopwatch and if time how how long it takes you to eat an entire meal. That's true. That's See, an at the table thing. That would be yeah. That would because be there's a lot of people. Who do that? Gamers. Yeah, to just see how fast I uh, eat food. I can eat fat food pretty fast. So what you got there to, to this review? This is actually from the Spirit Halloween store. The one I went to is actually the one on Gear Road uh, in Turlock. Queer Road? Uh, gear, Gear Road. Uh, Not queer? No. <laughs> uh, it's, uh, gear Road. Uh, G-E-E-R. Not it's, uh, by the, <laughs> No, no. Uh, it's it's uh, by the uh, CSU Stanislaus uh, College in, in Turlock, California, so if you're not from there, yeah. And this uh, got basically they have a whole bunch of stuff, but they have the purge section. So this, of course, is uh, a mask of Abraham Lincoln that you can wear when you purge on the twelve hours of uh, you know basically purging doing. Well, Halloween's only uh, two hours. Well, yeah, yeah, trick or treating that is. <coughs> and uh, so I bought this. My friend behind the camera wanted uh, he wanted actually he wanted an Uncle Sam mask, but they ran out. Uh, so all I had was Abraham Lincoln. I think Lincoln. they still had Uncle Sam. You just bought that because you killed Abe Lincoln. Uh, oh, yes. That's, uh, Abe Lincoln died on my I was thinking birthday. about that. He was shot it was in the a back coincidence. of the head. Oh, yeah. That's kind of a funny coincidence. Uh, he was shot <laughs> you in the head bought Abe Lincoln because... On April 14th. Uh, April 14th. And he's Captain Kirk's hero. Yes, he is. Yes. Help me, Kirk. Uh, it's uh, starting to get rougher. That is here. so uh, mean of a mask, too. You look at it. That is. He looks very angry. But he was a very uh, stoic and stern guy. But uh, you can wear it like this. And of course, when you go trick or treating or uh, purging, you could uh, wear this mask. You can wear it when you go to the bathroom. That's purging. That well, that is, yeah. You definitely will. You can, yes. And so it's uh. Now you need to go get yourself an Abe Lincoln mask to put on your wall. There's tons left. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Because after all, he, he he's he's on your birthday when you killed him. Yes, April, yeah, he died on April 15th. He was actually shot on April 14th, but died on April 15th. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I got this actually at the Spirit Halloween store. And they had tons of... Uh, so what other purge masks they have? Oh, uh, they had the uh, Statue of Liberty one where you wear it and it glows in the dark. That was a little bit more expensive. This well, one it I lights got, up, doesn't it? It does. Uh, it does light up. Uh, this one, actually, no, I, that one was thirty four ninety five. This is twenty nine ninety nine. I got a $20, uh, sorry, 20 Got a twenty percent off coupon with it. I think that's why they bumped their prices up for that reason. Of course, you print they out did. their coupons. True. It's or get like, it on the bottom of a uh, one of their receipts. True. Yeah. And uh, a, a store that used to do that was Mervin's. They would have really expensive stuff for the retail. Coles. Like they would, they would, oh, Coles. Yeah. Coles took that by Mervin's, by the way. Coles is not original. Coles stole everything they. Sorry. Coles is it's like probably has hired most of Mervin's. Uh, yeah. And uh, then they. But then what the deal thing is that then they have sales. That really just kind of knock it down to a normal price. And then you know people, Walmart's doing that now. Oh, yeah, the Walmart. Yeah, it's, it's an old trick. It's basically what they do is they have this retail. It's like $50. And it's like, oh, you get for half off, which then if you don't realize it, that's $25. That's the normal price. It's, you know, at Target. or at, uh, Yeah. So uh, it's basically the, at Target now because for yeah. the most part, so Walmart's it, not quite uh, a saving like it used to be. No, no. Walmart's actually more expensive, expensive than it used to be. Uh, it's Kmart. It's almost becoming Kmart's level. Oh, very much like Kmart, actually. Very uh, kind of uh, uh, since Kmart's gone, it's kind of like the you know Kmart part two. Uh, yeah, because George Soros has to make that extra money. He does get the, the cash, you know. Uh, you know, he only has a few billion. Billion. He needs a few billion more. So to support his society, open society. Exactly. And uh, so yeah, go ahead to the Spirit Halloween store. Uh, they're still open. Unfortunately, towards the, it's kind of depressing towards the end of October. Well, it was depressing at the beginning of October because well, that was more McHenry, but yeah, yeah. that one. But for the most part, it's like it, it's a, it's a cross pollination of, of all the other stores. It is, yeah. and it gave you some idea what all the other stores had. Yeah, it's uh, and so just well, you know what it is. Uh, a few reasons, uh, of course, with COVID and people, less people trick or treating. Also, too, the fact that uh, the Biden administration has never figured out the. Uh, import stuff that's sitting out at sea. And so you got to wonder how much stuff is uh, in those big tough... Uh, that's true. And also another thing with that is uh, another reason why over the years people have been less into Halloween and more into football. 
And so they're kind of pushing Halloween out for football because it's basically the. They're also game. pushing. Uh, they want to push Hall football Halloween out as a whole because. They say it's uh, diverse and not inclusive. Uh, oh, yeah. There's also that uh, Because the haves with, and the have-nots. Yeah, there is problems with that as well. Uh, which is, of course, that's, like I said, so there's all these things against Halloween. So, as you can see, Halloween's not as popular as... And then, too, it's also not... It's it's one age at a little kid, then it disappears, and then it's it's a hipster holiday. Yeah, yeah. And so. hipsters tend to holiday, want to celebrate it all year. They do. Would you? you know, the 30 to 40-somethings. True. As where the woke want to destroy it, because yeah, yeah. it's Big Brother's holiday. It is, and you can't have, and it, it is, there's definitely that whole against you know. You know it's already they were attacking fathers. Now they're attacking Big Brothers. Yeah, Big Brothers and fathers. With that. Yeah, so it's in your forties you'd be a father, but uh, but yeah, that's in your thirties be a Big Brother. But um, because you think about it, it'd be the early millennials and last generation uh, Gen Xers. Yeah. And they have a whole uh, culture war on the other 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 people, mainly the boomers. Yeah. And now they're attacking with the when you're attacking Halloween and Valentine's, those are hipster holidays. Yeah. Okay. So. You know, and when they're using the excuse the haves and have-nots as an excuse to do adversity and inclusion and and critical race theory uh, classes on Halloween to yeah, the kids to show that is racist. Yeah, uh, and the kids are racist for having it. True, and so if you have... Because uh, poor kids don't want to celebrate it, and kids with money do. Yeah. But at the same time, too, no one ever stops a poor kid from building his own costume. No, with, that's with true. With family or himself. That's true, yeah. It, it, or, yeah, that's true. You could actually just build your own Because I would, I, I would build my own costumes, me and my brother. And it'd be also... In that with way, my mom's help. And building your own costume, you're more original and... Uh, you definitely be, and sometimes you can be better than the stuff you get at the Halloween store. Yeah, I threw together a mad scientist costume, and I came in first place at Melanie School. Yeah, that's true. And also remember, don't forget at Anime, oh, sorry, at the Anime Club, uh, you were Bill Clinton. You had that kind of weird space move, space uh, S- man, Bill Clinton, all space the parts man, I Bill bought Clinton. that year. And you won that contest, and you danced with Rachel the. Uh, and that the, that pretty much stole the, the show. The president, yeah, she's pretty much president. And she was the creator, foundering president of. Uh, now she's a crazy lady. Yeah, well, <clears> you know. Not too surprised by that, <laughs> but uh, but yeah, so yeah, so you basically you could build your own, or you could do mix and match if you don't have that skill of making. But your own. but the mix and matching is uh, when I my one of my first jobs outside of uh, MJC because I used to work for MJC was a Halloween store. Oh okay. I right. was I had the highest sales because I could mix and match costumes for what people wanted to build. True. Yeah. You know you you could buy this and this and you can build this costume, but you're gonna have to spend a little bit more because you gotta need the cost. The, the, the suit from this, the head from this, and the hands from this. <clears throat> yeah. Like that. But. You can't do your own thing with that. Uh, so uh, you don't have to be. It's not like a purge where you just wear the mask and whatever you have on. True. And you just need to carry a big stick. And it, it fits pretty well. Yeah. And you could actually just pick up a stick or carry, you just get a knife or. <laughs> or a firearm. <laughs> firearm. But I think most people are going to dress like Antifa this year. It's, you know, it, it gives the poor kids the excuse to go out there. True, it does. Because they would do it anyways. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah might as well just, you know. Yeah. Uh, when in Rome, do what the Romans do. So. It's not that, that's not even when in Rome, do what the Romans do. It's just what little cheap bastards would do. Yeah, true. Because we, we knew a lot of people that had money and didn't want to do it. No, true. Yeah. You know, they would use the excuse they were have-nots, but they weren't. No, yeah. Just excuses. You know, Bonnie was a good example until uh, she realized she wanted to do steampunk, and all of a sudden she had money to do it. Oh, <laughs> which is, those are... Steampunk, steampunk stuff can be pretty expensive, so especially but, if you're gonna get the whole, uh, you know, uh, the coat and the hat. And the but the, but the thing, point being is, remember she complained she had no money. Yeah. And, and then all of a sudden, when it was something she did, there was stuff there that she wanted. All of a sudden, the money appeared. Yeah, it's true. That's kind of the you know, holding off. The same, so, you know. it's like, is it the, a battle of the haves or have-nots, or is it that they don't want to dress, work to dress what they want? They want everything built for them. Well, I think they want everything built for them, but, yeah. Because when you go to the, the the last two days, that's when all the cosplayers go rated for parts. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. When they have those, uh, so, you know, sometimes the, the 50 those, to 75% the 50% percent sells. And uh, they'll go rated for parts yeah. for costumes. Yeah, uh, which makes sense. Yeah. With that, you just go in there and just, you know, uh, limited uh, supply, but you get what you want. You get what you need, so. 
look through it like, I can use this for later. We'll use I'll probably later. go check, see if they have a new werewolf mask, because mine's kind of ripped. The oh, one I use yeah, all the time. stuff like that. Uh, true, I know. Well, I've had used it. I got it at Kmart. Remember? Oh, and I I've been that. using it for... The uh, in Oakdale. Oakdale. Yeah, I've been using it for like five years. Yes, yeah, a long time. And it's one of those uh, soft uh, foam masks. Those are nice. Yeah, those are pretty cool. Those are pretty, I have With a movable jaw. No, I don't have the one that moves the jaw. I think I have a, another one, but it's a soft mask, mask as well. Yeah, it's called his bondage mask. <laughs> he wears it while he's... No, not the Daredevil mask. He wears it with his Batman and Robin. It's not the Daredevil mask. With uh, Batman and Robin and their huge... Well, Batman's huge package and Robin's... Little George package. Clooney's little huge package. package. Which is a copy, so that's fake. He's, I doubt George Clooney. All of George Clooney is fake. That's true, yeah. Even his mind. But, uh, yes. But, yeah, it's... He's uh, friends with Obama. <laughs> he's writing his... Yeah. What was writing Obama's jock? Is it, what's the song from... Uh, Oh, the uh, Boondocks, riding yeah. Obama's dick. Yeah, riding Obama's dick. Yeah, that's, that's what George Clooney does. Uh, yeah, that guy. I never, I never understood the appeal. To that no, guy. I just, I don't get it. I mean, uh, well, he was on Roseanne, wasn't he? He was like, a, he's yeah. not a talent like uh, Alec Baldwin, but Alec Baldwin as a person is a piece of shit. Yeah, true. Especially she killing that one girl. Yeah, with that. So, oh, not, I shouldn't say it was, it was an accident, I guess. But, uh, <laughs> but he's responsible being a producer of the yes, film. Yes, he's responsible. Yes. You know, so it's a big mess. It, that looks, yeah, that looks, that's pretty bad. Yeah, that's, uh, that's something you definitely would. It know. couldn't happen to a nicer person, but the problem is the left and the right, the far left, I should say, the far right, are now fighting over is he innocent or guilty. True, yes, they are. With that. You know, that's why. And we'll, uh, next question is will Hollywood quit making movies with guns? Oh After shoot! This. I mean, that it might. It looks like it's going towards that way. Yeah, it was already going that way. Yeah, it was. Well, yeah, well, especially when the what did they? Is that true? With the ET they replaced the guns with walkie talkies. Uh-huh. Is that true? Okay. Uh, so it's like that. So I'm waiting for him to say they're going to replace uh, uh, all the uh, Nazis with uh, books <laughs> and throw them at you as they light them on fire. True. Yes. <laughs> But any last words? Well, like the that you killed Abe Lincoln. That I killed Abe Lincoln because, uh, and I, I saw the Titanic. And you the Titanic. Too, by the and way. you make Americans pay taxes. And I make Americans, good Americans, pay taxes. And, and bad ones. Not only am I that much of a douchebag, I also McDonald's. Yeah, you know, I, I, I'm killing all the people with heart attacks. And Is McDonald's on uh, your day wow. open? Uh, well, that's when Ray Kroc uh, made it. Uh, not it wasn't founded, but when it was uh, stolen. Stolen. Uh, so yeah, I'm just wow. Wow, you're just a piece of shit. I'm just a piece of shit. I mean, anyway. And by the way, uh, like I said, the Halloween stores, it's, uh, this year the theme is uh, Haunted Factory. And so go ahead. Not at the ones in Modesto I went to. No, no, the, the, the one in McHenry is lame. Lame. Uh, On the but right. Yeah, there are, all of them are pretty depressing. Uh, but, but Mike did think about buying himself a prop man. I like the bustle. They're all out of all guys. But you know the big fat guy with the uh, saws for hands? Never saw. Oh, he's pretty cool. He's gone now. He's bought out. But uh, Well, like, everyone sets them in the front yards. Yeah, they do. It's, uh, actually, down the street, uh, a couple blocks, they have a really cool display uh, with that, with these people doing like... You know, uh, people love certain... Halloween, and that's what they don't seem to understand. No, no, they don't. Last year, when they when, uh, was one of the early revolts of COVID, when you think about it. That was, yes. People were like saying, we're going to go trick-or-treating anyway, so screw you. Yeah. We don't care. Uh... And, but yeah, let's get the Halloween stores. They're open. And if you do want to wait to the 31st or the 1st, November, November 1st. It'll be, 30, it'll be the 1st and the 2nd. November 1st and November 2nd. Because the 31st, you, they, they try oh, to Oh, no, get, no. The 31st, they're going to, that's why everybody does the last minute shopping. So, Sometimes, uh, some some of the mall stores and Targets Are have their clearances. Yes. Yeah. Uh, but so, yeah, the clearance is towards the end. So if you want to wait for next year or if you cosplay, uh, go ahead and check those out. But at Spirit Halloween stores, I do recommend them uh, as well as. Uh, I don't because they're so pricey. Well, they are pricey. I'm, a, I, I don't I, I mean, I'm one of the have-nots. But I mean, or at least check it out. We'll I'm, I'm a have-nots. Mike's a have. I'm just saying. To he's check the it out. haves. No, I'm the have-nots. No, no, no. I like to say they. they I like had to have you pick up the Abe Lincoln mask for me. I know that was nice of me, but uh, I did use it. I like the way you you pat yourself on the back. I the self insured of narcissism. Oh, well, hell yeah, hell. So that's... this is the sounding board signing off. Now we need to shoot him in the back of the head. <laughs>